Hello there, Internet. I'm going to do something today. I'm going to brave the world, and I'm going to go into the city, into downtown, and get some coffee at a cute cafe, hopefully maybe a little breakfast item, and read a book. I have been putting this off for quite literally weeks. Every time I go into work in the morning, I look at the city and the sun rising over the city, and I go, hey, I want to experience that from the city. So on the weekend, I'll go in in the morning. It'll be fine. I'll love it. Cut to me three weeks later not having done it yet. So... Today is the day. I asked a friend who lives more closely to downtown and has lived here for a year or two, at least, what is the best coffee place downtown? He told me, told me he wasn't gonna tell me anything about it, but told me to tell him my reactions. So, we are going to Spy House Coffee in downtown. Now there's multiple locations, but he sent me an address. So that's the one I'm going to. So a hip hop, a hip and hop, let's go. I don't know, where's the camera? I am at a stoplight, so let's quickly name my fears. Parking and getting murdered. All right, we've parked, but we've parked in a parking garage, which really scares us on thing number two. But it's okay, I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna walk to the coffee shop. It's gonna be fine. It's broad daylight in downtown. Whoa. <laughs> I feel like a small girl in a big city. Hello, I am back home. <laughs> Exploring is great. Going on adventures is great. However, as we know, anxiety. And I named my anxieties about this excursion on the way there, which was parking and getting murdered. <laughs> so let's go through my anxiety a little bit. So when it came to the actual act of finding a parking spot, my anxiety was probably at about a seven. Then when it came to leaving the parking, leaving my car, going through the parking garage to the street, Anxiety was probably at a nine. Once I got to the street, I was amazed by the city and the sky and the the buildings and so on and so forth. Uh, so my anxiety probably went down to like a six. Then I found the coffee place. And when I got in there, I was still pretty much at a six. I looked on the menu on my phone so I knew what I wanted when I went up there, which helped me so that it stayed roughly at a six-ish, six or five. Sitting, I would say maybe it stayed at a five. It stayed for like 30 minutes. I think even longer than 30 minutes. So that's cool. When I knew I was about to leave, my anxiety probably rose to like a six, six and a half. I walked out and I was like, okay, am I gonna walk around more? Am I just gonna go to my car? And the six of my anxiety was like, go to your car. By the time I got to the block where I parked, my anxiety was probably at eight. Why? Because there was like random men <laughs> sporadically placed. And I was like, oh, it's like a an obstacle course. <laughs> I got to the parking garage and we we're at a nine. I came in on a different street and I didn't really want to walk around <laughs> to that street just because of the sporadic men. So I was like, okay, well, let me find a door on this street. And I didn't see one. I saw like a weird little scary alley and I was like, not going down that. Walked in through like the e the entrance of driving, okay? I was looking around for an elevator, didn't see one because they say you're supposed to pay by the elevator and I was like, I don't see my elevator. So I just like walked up to my car because I was not like that high up. Walked to my car and got in my car and that is the glass clip you saw. At that point we were at an 11. I calmed myself down enough to get out of my car, 
go to the elevator that I had seen before and try and go down there and pay. However, the elevator just didn't come. I hit the button, didn't come. And I was like, that's a sign, go back to the car. So I went back to the car and I was like, I'll just drive down there. There's gotta be another place to pay. I went to go to the exit and it was like, do you have your paid ticket? And I was like, no, I don't. Oh, so I got down to the bottom and then I was like, okay, I think this looks like a place to pay from my car. So eventually I figured that out. It was $20 and at that point I was like, just get me out of here. And I got out of there. Yeah, I'm still a little shaky, honestly. That is adventuring with anxiety. Okay, okay, okay. I can't film with you doing that, man. But I did it. I went downtown even though I was scared to. And I got coffee. Where's my coffee? Coffee! We went downtown. We went to the city. You didn't die and you found a place to park. We got this. I'm gonna go read and I will see you guys next time. Bye! There's a pretty big lake 